Hi, my name is Beth Terry. I live in Oakland, California. And this is all the plastic waste that I generated in 2009. It's 3.8 pounds, which ends up being about 4% of what the average American generates in a year. So why am I picking on plastic? First of all, plastic doesn't biodegrade and most of it can't be recycled, so it lasts in landfills virtually forever, or ends up littering our streets and making its way to beaches and the ocean. It harms animals. Even my cat got sick from eating plastic, and chemicals leaching into our food can harm people. Enough is enough. I committed to using as little plastic as possible. This is how much plastic I used in six months in 2007. And this is my plastic for the entire year of 2009. This stuff is all cat related. Plastic cat litter bags, switch into paper this year. Plastic supplement powder, because we make our own cat food and this is the only plastic related to it. Plastic flea killer, because Oakland has hella fleas. And one tiny little plastic bag of kitty treats that were a gift from somebody nice. Expired plastic credit cards and gift cards. Medical packaging, over-the-counter medicine bottles, prescription bottles, and band-aids. Plastic toothpaste tube, which I won't be getting anymore because I switched to aluminum tubes that are recyclable, all except for the plastic caps. Food-related plastic, caps from glass milk bottles, other miscellaneous caps from glass bottles, a couple plastic wine corks, one straw, three condiment containers I ended up with from restaurants, and the seals from a few ice cream containers because no one is perfect. Here's a plastic scoop from a box of laundry detergent, but all the rest of our detergent doesn't have a plastic scoop. Here's a tag from a race that I participated in. Did you know that these things are actually plastic? This is all shipping related plastic. Plastic packing tape, plastic envelope windows, and a few plastic envelopes. I try to get off mailing lists and I request recycled paper tape from vendors. And here are a bunch of plastic bags that honestly, I don't even remember what was in them. Electronics related plastic, printer cartridge wrappers, battery charger and rechargeable batteries to replace disposables, camera battery packaging, phone memory card, and that's about it. You saw my plastic collection, you saw what I did collect this year. Now here's some things you didn't see and you won't see. Plastic grocery bags, no way man. We bring our own bags, our own canvas bags. We don't use produce bags either. We stick our vegetables directly in the bag. But if you do want to use a produce bag, there are cloth ones instead. This is organic cotton, plain drawstring bag, or net bag. You won't find any plastic trash bags in our house. Because we compost all of our food waste, we use a biodegradable liner, we recycle as much as we can, and the little bit that's left is dry, so we stick it in the trash can without any liner at all. Synthetic sponges? No way, man. You won't see plastic toilet paper or paper towel wrappers in our house, because now we use toilet paper that comes wrapped in paper, and this is recycled. And for to instead of paper towels, we use biodegradable cloths, coconut scrubbers, copper scrubbers, and baking soda actually makes a really great scouring powder. You didn't see soda bottles. We make our own soda with our soda maker. Plastic water bottles. Did you know that a lot of bottled water is actually tap water? Who needs it? I can take my stainless steel bottle and bottle my own tap water. You didn't see frozen dinner trays. We just don't eat them anymore. No way did you see plastic snack bags or plastic candy bags. You can buy snacks in bulk from natural food stores. Bring your own container, have them weigh it before you fill it up, and then the cashier can deduct the weight of the container. What do you put it in? This? No way. You can get cute little containers like this. They have sections. They also have ones that have one section. Good for sandwiches. You didn't see any takeout containers. We take our own containers to restaurants for leftovers. Didn't see any DVDs, we rent them. Didn't see any CDs, we download them. Ah, didn't see any coffee cups and didn't see any of these plastic beauties. I bring my own mug. 
You can put hot stuff in here, you can put cold stuff in here, it doesn't matter. What about this straw? And what about this plastic fork? Didn't see him. I bring my own, I bring a spoon, a knife, a fork, chopsticks, and even my own reusable glass straw. I have so many more ideas for ways to reduce your plastic waste on my website at fakeplasticfish.com.